were vaults. Um, he definitely had many corny jokes that made class fun. He always made you feel welcomed in class. Like sometimes people just show up in our classroom and he like teach them if they needed something. So he definitely made school more fun and probably like my favorite teacher ever. <laughs> Mr. Spang, definitely. He was one of the funniest men I've ever met in my life, and he's just made me enjoy the subject that he taught. In high school, as a freshman, Mr. Wright's really influenced me to get involved with student government. And now, as a senior, I'm student government president, and it's my favorite part of high school, so I'm really thankful that he influenced me to get involved with that. Mrs. Ehrman? Uh, because she helped me out like when I like in tough times like when I struggle you know with school or you know when I had like my depressed time she was there to help me out and she gave me good advice taught me how to be a student an athlete and all that and I, I want to say another teacher um, my guidance counselor Mrs. McGough uh, she's a great lady she helped me out too um, she's the reason why I'm here graduating today so I just want to give a big thank you to them both of them Mr. Bradley, he's a science teacher, because he kept the classroom fun um, and he taught the whole school agenda as well as teaching us about ourselves. Elementary school would have to be Mrs. Braun by far. Seven years later, what, seven years, fifth grade, uh, she's still my favorite person, my favorite teacher. She had, uh, she had this incredible way of just making every student in her class enjoy coming to school. I mean, I've always loved school, I've always loved coming to school, but she made me walk into her classroom every single day with a smile on my face and enjoy learning and like, I don't, I don't know, I don't know what to say. It has to be my Spanish teacher, Ms. Gonzalez. She was like a second mom to me and she was willing to help me through anything. Um, Mr. Amato from Nichman. Um, he's my favorite because he always told me that I could do better than what I was doing. He encouraged me to always try my best and that I was a lot more than what I was putting down on paper and I think that really made me do better in high school. The first one is definitely Mrs. Carla Erdman um, because not only does she strive to make sure that students uh, try their best, but she's a tough one and she's tough because she cares and honestly the way that she teaches has made me a better student. Um, I liked all my elementary school teachers so it was kind of hard but uh, my favorite I'd have to say would be Mr. Siegfried um, because he's still involved in my life. He still comes to all my football games. Um, he still writes me letters or recommendations for scholarships or just to help me get into college and stuff and so he's still heavily involved in my life which is nice. Middle school teacher, um, Mama Jeffress. She started. Uh, she started paving my way for my future and helping me onto the right tracks. My favorite middle school teacher is Miss Saudi. Um, she was one of those teachers that always made you like want to strive to be better and want you to succeed in the classroom. And you could tell she just truly cared for your, the student's success. So in fifth grade at Spring Garden Elementary School, I had Mrs. Lauren Brennan, and for the same reason that I appreciated her Norwood so much. I felt that Mrs. Brennan always had her students' best interests at heart, and she was so attentive to all of her students at all times that she noticed quickly how much I care about learning, just for the pure sake of learning. And so she pushed me more quickly and more thoroughly than any teacher had up until that point. And I think that really solidified and ignited my love of learning, which has carried me through high school. Mr. Anderico. Mr. Cartooth. Between Mrs. Kruger. Mrs. Koski. Mrs. Miranda. Say Mr. Dectus. Mr. Samuel Norwood. Mr. Schaefer. Mr. Cleffy. Mrs. Brennan. Uh, Mr. Safranic and Mr. Walesa. Mr. Frank. We Mr. Tossy. Mr. Little. Mr. Downey. Mr. Glick. We Mrs. Villani. Uh, Mrs. Hauser and Mrs. Erdman. And Mrs. Macemore. Say Miss Fowler. She's like the second mom to me. 